What up, folks? I am Ultrazilla. Thought you were gonna get that guy again. Uh, and today I have a review of the Power Rangers Mighty Morphin Megazord. This is the Cheapo Megazord by Hasbro. These were available, I guess, at like Family Dollar, Dollar General type places. I got mine on Amazon. Uh, this, there was a seller, third party seller, selling through Amazon uh, for nine bucks instead of the 10 bucks that they go for in those stores. So, uh, okay. Uh, plus, I had prime points. So I got this and one other item and uh, it was all free. What I have to do, let's get to the review. So let's start things off with a quick size comparison with a couple of other MMPR Megazords that I've reviewed here on the channel, as well as I got, this guy's still here. Um, the Dino Fury uh, Megazord that we just reviewed, though I don't know if you're seeing these back to back or what. I just I, I don't know what comes in here and things get thrown off. I am reviewing these back to back if you want to know a little bit behind the scenes. Eh? Eh? And that's mostly because reviewing these guys back to back seem right since they're kind of cheapo megazords but this is like really cheap the other one has i feel like more going on for it not just the size but the sculpt work and all that uh this guy is a really 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 basic and you know the figures i'm talking about the you know they have them at walgreens too like the like avengers uh like super 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 basic figures bigger though that's what this line is whatever it i don't know if they have a name for this line i think in transformers are like the evergreen ones whatever they're called uh but here's a power sword he's got one of those um okay sculpt just on in gray plastic it's got a little circle over here uh but it's okay it's got a little circle over there uh fits his hand okay but uh if you might have seen he's holding it out to the side that that that's that that's all he could do with it because articulation, head rotates, and the arms are rotate, and that's it. <laughs> Nothing else. So the proportions on this guy are interesting too. Um, very skinny, very thin, um, very not Megazord, <laughs> but not terrible within itself. Like, the legs are really long, but the arms are kind of long, torso's kind of long, so... Within itself, proportionally, I'd say it's fine. Also got some weird things going on where the arms are, except for the shoulders, all in black, and then these are painted. I'll bring it in closer, sorry. Let's take a look. Painted shoulders here actually look really good. Mastodon! Uh, painted across the chest in silver. This is one whole piece in red. Decent detail. And then, uh, Saber Tooth Tiger Leg. It's just all yellow. They didn't bother to paint this section. Um, the Triceratops Leg is all in blue. They didn't part paint this section. Uh, but, I don't know. It's, it's not terrible. It, these are kind of squished. But, like, the detail isn't bad. Man, that's playing tricks on my camera. Oh, I love when figures do that. Been a while since we had that, but it's a thing that happens sometimes. So the yellow you're seeing is... N the it, That's that's the proper yellow. I don't know why when I get close it does that, but... Um, the details are pretty good. Here we go. How about I zoom in instead of bringing the figure in? The details are pretty good. I do have to say, I do like the details. They are scrunched, especially, especially this one. Um, Sabretooth is really scrunched up, but the details are not bad. The details aren't bad in the arms either, I gotta say. Not so bad. On the back, I, I, you got the mold of detail there. You really do. It's all there. On the side, it's there. Molded details all throughout. Look at the back. That's pretty good. The, uh, sh you know, the arms, just in black, as I said, but, I mean, not terrible? You know what I'm saying? Not terrible. And then the head sculpt, I think is okay. You got the silver paint, you got the yellow paint for the eyes. It's a little overdone, but it's fine. 
You do got the white line going up here. Uh, you got yellow painted up here. Not perfect, but you know, it is what it is. It's not bad, guys. This is definitely not bad. Um, I do have to say, I don't hate this. Uh, and I'm glad I didn't, I wasn't looking for this. It popped up. You know what I'm saying? I was actually looking forward to combining Dino Fury Megazord, which I do have on pre-order at Entertainment Earth, but I'd rather have it on Amazon. You know how that works. Um, but this guy came up and I was like, oh, that guy. I think I need to get that guy because I never had a chance to get him anywhere. I'd never seen him. So, yeah. I, I don't mind him, guys. I don't mind him. And this is a perfect little thing. If you want to do some wacky customizations, I do have something in mind that I might try. Uh, but I got to talk to my wife to see uh, how, you know, what kind of paint we could use and stuff uh, for that little trial if I decide to do it. I'm not going to tell you what it is because if I don't do it, then you'll be disappointed. But this guy's not bad. And my final thoughts. It's not terrible for $9, actually for free. I mean, that's the thing, right, guys? Like, I didn't pay anything for it. It was just prime points for me. So, um, you know, my, I, I will admit the review is skewed with that. It's like, freebie, yeah, this is great, you know? But I don't think it's terrible overall. Like, the molded detail is there. It's weird, proportions are a little odd, but not within itself. So I don't know guys, like, um, there's worse things you could do with nine, 10 bucks. You know what I'm saying? Um, especially if you love this Megazord, you know, uh, like I do. I, I pretty much, you know, I'm almost all in from <laughs> this point. Like whenever I see this guy, I'm like, okay, I gotta get him. Um, I, I just like him like that, you know, but you know, your mileage is gonna vary. So, you know, that's it. <laughs> that's my review. <laughs> Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts below. And if you please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram. Stay safe. Till next time. Peace out, peace.